Hello again, it's Roy Brooks once more and you're in my garage where it's all nice and warm and cosy and lots of bits and pieces for you to have a look at. Right, this week it's going to be a picture and I think it's a super little picture too. Here we are, just look at that because it's of a Singer Junior 848 1929. At least that's what my researchers say and funnily enough on the back it says with love from Dilly's 1929, so I hope I'm going to be right. Interesting features, it's the first of the singers with only, uh, with rather four wheel brakes, because they previously had two wheel brakes. Notice that the petrol filler cap, a bit hard to see, but it's in front of the um, windscreen there. And you know, those are very dangerous, those things. I once saw a car set on fire through being overfilled, with a petrol filler there, spilled onto the engine, the hot engine, went up in flames. We've also got the tie rod here between the front wings, just to stop the front wings from flapping. Just let's look at the fixed starting handle down here. Then the starting handle, of course, was the where the motor car would be started, not like just pressing the starter these days, we always do. We have a fixed handle to get out and swing it rather quickly. We also can see only just the registration letters, either EU or FU. EU was Breckenshire and FU was parts of Lindsay. So there we are, that's the nice little photograph. You see these occasionally these days at flea markets and so on, and I reckon this would be well worth five to ten pounds. <laughs> 